<sighs> Welcome, greetings and salutations to another Eve's it's vocabulary of the week. Maybe. Today we're going to be looking at the following words. Right. And to start off with, the word pedantic. Now, this word can be used in reference to people you just think are just stuck up. The word basically means lacking in imagination, intellectually showy, or arrogant. So, basically, you could say, dude, that guy's way of talking is so pedantic. Or, our teacher is so pedantic. I even have a... Hey. Hey. A sentence that I wrote out for each one. Since apparently my handwriting is better than that of Undertaker Street. It is... I find the, the music written that is both written and performed by Nicki Minaj to be pedantic. <laughs> or I find Lady Gaga to be pedantic. Now, let's get away from that word. I'm starting to seem pedantic myself. <laughs> okay. Next word is impecunious. It has the definition of being. <laughs> having little to no money. And if you read the book Moby Dick, I believe the main character, Ishmael, describes himself as being impecunious, you know, having little to no money in his, his purse or pocket. I didn't read the book, but I'm well aware that's the first line that they actually say. <laughs> and a good example of this, of a sentence that you can write out, could be, as of late, I could be considered, I myself could be considered impincutious. That's by the fact I have no job. And this one, I think a lot of people who... This one you can use on those really obnoxious fans, you know, really obnoxious ones. And it's the word obsequious. I'm sorry if I don't pronounce it correctly, but it's obsequious. And it's spelled O-B-S-E-Q-I-U-S. And you can use it to describe a event. I use this sentence to do this. It's most teenage age girls are considered obsequious when talking about just the beaver. Ah. The word basically means is exhibiting a fawning tent. Attentiveness. Yes. I guess technically it would be swooning, but close enough. You know, options or rats, anyways. <laughs> Alright. Next word, and this one you probably have never heard of, but probably have seen it enough. And it's non book. I had to look this one up in a dictionary, a very old one. It probably when back when they actually had printed dictionaries. And that was the only way you could find out about it. Well, you know, get in trouble. It was by a book. <sighs> the definition is a book of little of little literary merit that is often a compilation. 
right? And within print, it has in parentheses as of pictures or speeches. So, a good sentence exam example I can use in a sentence is I have five non books based on the subject of birds in flight. So, basically, I just have birds that are books about birds in flight. Uh, basically, there are pictures of birds in flight. <laughs> pretty, pretty, fly, my pretties, fly. And use these words to better yourselves, hopefully. <laughs> Anyways, thank you. And that was another Eve's vocab. And I will put a link down in the description for those who want, want to look at the other vocab words that are on, as you know it, Study Blue. So, it's another great way to have, have, have flashcards on the go on your cell phone. Anyways, thank you for listening and have a great night.